How's it going? And I hope you're all doing well. So it's been a couple of weeks since I've been able to do a video, so I've managed to get my act together today and get out and get one done. Um, we're in the middle of October here in Scotland, so the autumn colours are really quite vibrant. So that's my plan today. I'm going to go out and just try and get a few autumn pictures. I've not had the chance this year. So I am heading down to a place down in Ayrshire um, called Dalkerney Falls, somewhere I've never been before. Um, I've seen a few pe uh, pictures over the years and I thought myself it must look really good in the autumn. So I'm going to head down there and see if we can get a shot. After that, I'll probably just head down towards Air Harbour. And there's another shot there I've been laughed after a number of years and never had the chance to get. So I'm going to take a pop down there as well. Um, weather's to stay dry. That in Scotland in October, it's, that's highly doubtful. So jacket and the umbrella are with me anyway, just in case. So I better stop talking, get myself down here and see if we can get any decent pictures. <music> That's me at Dalkerney Falls, as you can see behind me. And I'll be honest, the colours are absolutely brilliant. And I think I've picked just about the right time to come. Absolutely stunning. There's nobody here, just myself. So I'm just going to potter around for a while, take some video shots, take some pictures, and just enjoy myself because uh, honestly, it's so, so nice. Uh, first picture I'm going for is just this tree here. I've got it at the right hand side of the frame, and the branch you can see at the top here basically frames a waterfall we'll get some really nice autumn leaves below it so I'm literally here five minutes and I've got a picture that I'm really happy with so keep it up and see what else we can get So a couple of minutes ago I just said that I had the place to myself, now I don't. <laughs> Other guys, uh, wetsuits, life jackets, helmets and stuff on, away for a swim. I'm not quite sure if it's just for pleasure or whether they're actually doing something, I'm not quite sure, but I don't think it would be me to be honest. I was going to hang around for a while, uh, use this time to kind of scope about, see if there's any other shots I can get, and hopefully they'll not be too long and I can get a decent shot. So the guys have started to move a wee bit further down the stream, so I managed to get myself another couple of shots. Again, similar to the last one, just kind of framing it in between the trees. And we got a nice wee bit of light there as well, which is great, so... Really happy with it so far. Gonna go and wander about, um, just see what else is here. See if I can get one more shot and then I think I'm gonna head down towards Air Harbour and see if I can get down there.
Right, so I'm now down in Ayr, and I'm down at Ayr Harbour, and what I'm actually trying to do is I'm trying to take a shot of an old shipwreck called the Kafir, or the Kafir Wreck. Um, it's just off the harbour, it's only about 180 metres out or something. Um, the tide at the moment is a bit high, so I can only see a wee bit of it. So I'm just going to sit about here, have a spot of lunch, and then once the tide's low enough to get the shot that I'm looking for, I'll get out, because at the moment the sky's not looking too clever, so I'm going to sit here, have a bit of lunch, and hope the tide gets low enough. Okay, so I'm just trying to get some shots of the wreck. I'm um, just standing at the shore wall. I'm going to go for two different shots. As you can see, there's some lovely light rays behind me. So I'm going to go for a really long exposure around about a minute and 20 seconds. And I'm also going to go for one around about 15 seconds and just see if I can pick out some of that detail in the sky. It's getting a bit cold, so I'm not going to stand here long. Uh, maybe another five minutes or so and uh, well, that light behind me is really, really good. And then I'll shoot off for a bit. But at the moment, it's going really well. That's me finished for the day. Um, pretty, pretty happy with that picture, but it's definitely somewhere I'll come back to, um, probably in the winter and maybe early morning. I think it could look quite nice. Before I go, I'm just going to plug my 2023 calendar, which is available to purchase on my website. Um, you'll be able to see that here. Uh, I'll put the link in the, the description there. They're £10 each and £2.50 for postage and packaging. So if you want one, then that's great. Uh, thanks very much for your order. Uh, but I'm going to call it quits today, so thanks very much for watching. If you enjoyed it, then please hit the like button. And if you really enjoyed it, then remember to hit subscribe as well. So thanks very much, and I'll see you all later.